Hello and welcome to another video. Today we can all learn how to craft exotic eye. Let's begin. Before we begin video, be sure to check out our host BerryBite. They are a very reputable and very good host. And let's begin. So first items on our list are Elder Prismarine Coral and Prismarine Coral. So where do you find those? You find them in the water. And basically you collect the Prismarine Coral few of them, you already got this item. Because to get this item, you just leave Prismarine Color to dry. And yeah, you need two of those and one of Elder Prismarine Coral. The Atame, I don't know how to pronounce it, item is obtained from Deeplink Priests. Now you can find Deeplink Priests two ways. You can go and find a sunken city, or you can just fish and eventually you're gonna fish a Deeplink Priest. And when killed, he will drop the Atame. And the Eye of Abyss helps you find the sunken cities. And you craft it with 4 Crying Obsidian and 4 Obsidian and 1 Eye of Ender. And when you throw it, it will point you to the nearest sunken city. Again, which you can either go hunt and get the priests and or fish them. But I would recommend using Eye of Abyss because fishing is RNG. Then you need Crystallized Coral, which also can be found in Sunken Cities, so Eye of Abyss is really useful here. And you get it from Coral Chunk, which oops, wrong button, is obtained for coral, coral, coral Sus. Yeah, Coral Sus. And it's a pretty strong mob, so be sure to check uh, to take out the gear with you. But once you get four of them, you can make Crystallized Coral, like so. The Eye of Ender you can make with any uh, Eye of Enders plus Blaze Rod and you get Eye of Ender if you don't know. And this Endermans really like to learn in my atmosphere like you really need to stop spawning out you know under my exhibition. And last few items are well Pristine Diamond which you get by combining eight di I mean seven diamonds, Sandpaper and Ancient Geode. Same recipe is for pristine emerald, sandpaper, ancient geode, and seven emeralds. Now for this to obtain Neptunium ingot, you need few items. So first of all, prerequisite is to get any uh, custom rod, iron, gold, diamond, and so on. And this is how you craft them. You need a stick, two iron ingots, and two string. And you get an iron rod, and you need a tackle box which is crafted with 5 iron ingots, block of iron, chest and 2 kelp. The tackle box is used to store your fishing stuff and iron fishing rod is just, you know, a better fishing rod. And then you need to fish a lot and pray to the RNG Jesus that you gonna get Neptunium crate or bounty or Neptunium ingot from fishing because it's really really annoying. But yeah, once you got all of those items, there is no special crafting, for example, as in Clockwork Eye, you just take out the items and just put them in the crafting table like so, and voila, you got yourself an exotic guy. Thank you guys for watching, you know what to do, like, share, subscribe, do what you do best, and stay awesome. See you guys next time, bye!